Mexican food. We're going to uh, the Spinning Chicken. Finish his house. At April 1st. Or April else, Fools? he said April 1st, and that's his elaborate April Fool's joke. April Fool's joke. See, now that he's wrong. playing on us. Right yeah, and he'll jump in late at April afternoon, and he'll be like, You've been brigged! I'm not coming back! You're not going on a cruise. Yeah. You're going on a cruise? Yeah, are you yeah. serious? Where are you going? Uh, I think Cabo. Cabo? Yeah. Wow. He hasn't decided. That's he's great. Who are you going with? Are you going pathetically by yourself? No, that'd be great. Oh, that'd be awesome. Are you out of your mind? Yeah, Ren. Ren's like, hello, Nobody ladies. Keep an eye on I'm, employed. <laughs> I'm employed. I'm employed. That's right. Because totally. um, I'm always teaching the boys about what women really want. I, I don't want to hear it. I don't even know. It's security. Bringing home the bacon. Security. But he's Person. confident. Oh, but yeah, he's confident, it's, right? It's, yeah. It's security he's got it all figured out. That's the one. And check out Ren. Leg crossed, fedora. Rit, ladies, Ren knows what's going on. Oh yeah, here it comes. Oh my gosh, whole avocados. Pretend this isn't creepy, okay? Have that on there. All right. So this is what you get at the Gallo Vito. Oh, thank you, yeah. What is it? Spicy like guacamole? guacamole? Like, That's nice. Okay, so who here likes hot food? Hot, hot? What about you? I'm the only one that likes it mild. I like it mild. Okay. Because I asked him to make everything ultra mild. I can taste it. Like it doesn't burn off my mouth. Right. I've never understood that. When I go to Indian restaurants or Thai restaurants, I want it hot enough that it makes me sweat while I'm eating it. Oh wow. Oh. That's outstanding. It just, it just well, nice. thank you, Tasha. I'm not the only person here with uh, a sensitive palate. I don't like it that hot. <laughs> I am enjoying this I so do. much. Right Will it burn my mouth? It'll destroy your mouth. Okay, and in case you're wondering who this is, this is Tasha, who is the studio gopher slash She's Anything. Assistant. Just oh heavens! <laughs> you know I've been trying to avoid the word assistant in Thailand. I know. <laughs> like I still don't know what to say yeah, that you are. Remember, I'm I'm a steward. Your steward? steward? A steward. That's right. Steward. That was the original thing. Yeah. So anyway, but don't get emotionally attached to Tasha because we're still determining if she's going to implode under the pressure. The devil wears Prada pressure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I told my friend Dustin, and he doesn't know anything about Warhammer. I explained to him, you know, how I paint and create art and stuff like that. He, he was like blown away by it. Like, well, it'd be I like believe. testing golf courses. Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew. What's your poison? Horchata. Horchata. What about you? Is that your favorite thing? No. Not your normal thing? Well, I mean, it's good. I'm just trying to stay away from soda. Uh, yeah, me too. Okay, and? Wise choice. What do you got? What? What are you drinking? Horchata. Horchata. Muy bueno. People like to say horchata. Yeah, actually, yeah but actually, I only took a little bit. I actually have a reason why I drink Mountain Dew over other soda. Mountain Dew tastes the same when the carbonation's gone. Okay, oh yeah, look at that. Oh, my Giant goodness Giant pile of food. Bazinga. I think it's the best show on TV. Big Bang Theory? Yes, by far. I love that right. show. Okay, everybody feeling good? Wrong. Secretly. Secretly. <laughs> Secretly. Hey, well, hope you enjoyed having lunch with us. And um, we're hoping to do this more often. You know, ever since Brig left, yeah, we just haven't had the heart to go out. Okay. Do you want to hear a crazy shrimp story? And how. Okay. So I was in Japan. I was 19 years old visiting a girlfriend of mine. Um, and we went down to Kyoto. Either it's like small lobster or really big shrimp. Because when they brought the shrimp out, they were about this long. 
Oh wow! And they were alive. It's probably a frog. And they were oh just my God. recently shish kebab. Right. But they're still alive, calm down. And the guy turns his grill on and gets all of his oils and everything set up. You know, gets you know some vegetables going, this kind of thing. And then he and then he flicks this thing, this live shrimp, onto the hot plate, and it scrambles for the edge. And he gets this lid and goes, and covers it up, oh. drags it back to the middle. And here it going, and then it stops after a second. Then he cracks a lid, squirts some oil in there, and holds it. <laughs> Shuffles it around a little bit, pops it off, and then just you know. Up or that down, right is down. the most disturbing thing. <laughs> no, third most disturbing thing I've ever. Then, then, then I had this piece of kale. I was putting it into my blender, and the kale was like Woo! so gross, but I ate it anyway. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm crazy. Kale will decide to the turkey. You're a genius. <laughs> I probably have bees in my. Teeth. I've been to sushi bars where, they, where people have ordered like entire plates of just shrimp. So we all smell like smoked meat now. Especially my hair. Mm. Yeah, that's the awesome. that's the smell oh, Sarah up. likes. Fume that women should be wearing. They should be putting. They should be putting meat smells. Planters, planters, like, who's in this movie? Kevin Bacon. <laughs> the lady with the, the Sounds unibrow. Sounds delicious. What? Oh, yeah. Planters cashew. A uh, commercial from Super Bowl two years ago. Uh, way to a man's heart and all that. that Whoa, strawberry yeah, body lotion? What? That's like on its own. You just have to get it started. All right, we're back. We're back home after a long adventure. Ah! <laughs> 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 it's...